Uh, hello. In this video, we will uh, derive the equation of the tangent of an ellipse at a particular point P. So the coordinates of this point are x1, comma y1. So the first thing that uh, we should uh, do is uh, we should take another point on the ellipse. So let's say Q with coordinates x2, y2. And then we should try and get the uh, equation of a line passing through these two points P and Q, which is nothing but a secant line. And here I am assuming that uh, we know how to get the equation of a line passing through two points. So if I start writing equation of the secant, pq will be y minus y1 is equal to slope of the line which is uh, y2 minus y1 by x2 minus x1 multiplied by x minus x1 okay so the idea here is if uh, Q approaches point P. If Q is a point very close to point P on the ellipse, the equation of the secant will automatically become the equation of the tangent. Okay, so this yellow line. Okay, now here since both the points are on the ellipse, they must satisfy the equation. So we can uh, write that x1 square by a square plus y1 square by b square should be 1 and uh, similarly x2 square by a square plus y2 square by b square this is also 1. Now subtracting uh, the first equation from the second equation we can uh, notice that here let me write it here uh, we get x2 square minus x1 square by a square this is equal to uh, sorry I should retain that in the left hand side itself y2 minus y2 square minus y1 square by b square and the right hand side uh, that's 0 1 minus 1 that's 0 so here uh, let's open them up Okay, so a square minus b square is a plus b into a minus b. So we can write this as uh, x2 minus x1 into x2 plus x1 by a square. So let me take uh, this to the right hand side. So I'll have a minus and then y2 minus y1 into y2 plus y1 by b square. So from here uh, we are attempting to get the slope of the secant line. So y2 minus y1 by x2 minus x1 is the slope. So if I take this b square and then minus to the left hand side I will get minus b square upon a square and then uh, what is left here? I have x2 plus x1 by y2 plus y1. Okay, now I can take this and then substitute in the equation of the tangent line. Sorry, secant line. Okay, so here uh, we have y minus y1 is equal to. So, what is the slope that we obtained? It is minus b square by a square. square multiplied by x2 plus x1 by y2 plus y1 into x minus x1. Okay, so here uh, if the secant is let's say becoming the tangent. Okay, so when does this happen? Okay, so when the point Q approaches point P. Okay, so here 
So this point Q is very close to point P. So that means uh, there should not be any difference or there's hardly any difference between the X coordinates and the Y coordinates. So we can uh, claim that uh, Y2 is approximately Y1 and X2 is approximately X1. So we can substitute those here. So we get minus B square by A square. I can write this as 2X1 by 2y1 into x minus x1. Okay, so now I think uh, let's take maybe a square and then y1. We can leave those twos. We can cancel them out. a square and y1 to the left hand side and then uh, retain b square on the right hand side. So what do we get? Oh, no, no, no. I have a change of mind. Let's take b square to the left hand side and y1 to the left hand side a square should remain on the right hand side okay so what do we have we will have y y1 uh, y b square minus y1 square by b square okay so minus 1 by a square is on the right hand side so if i write it minus x x1 by a square Okay, so that minus into minus that becomes plus. So we have x1 square by a square. Okay, so this is what we have. And then uh, we can take this to the left hand side and then this you can take it to the right hand side. So we will end up having x x1 by a square plus y y1 by b square is equal to x1 square by a square plus y1 square by b square and then if you look at uh, this uh, that is this equation right so that means there is simply one so what do we have so this is one so the equation of the tangent line at a particular point on the ellipse is x x1 by a square plus y y1 by b square is equal to 1. Now, uh, I think one easy way to remember how to obtain this uh, equation is simply if you have x square in the equation of the ellipse, x square you can visualize it as x multiplied by x and then one of the x's is replaced with the point where we are trying to get the tangent line so it becomes x x1 similarly y square if you write it as product of y and y one of the y's is replaced with the y coordinate y y1 so you basically have x x1 by a square plus y y1 by b square equal to 1 this is the equation of the tangent line drawn at a point p on the ellipse